on your spot. And you can teach this with a mat. Well, I'll bring a towel out here in a second on how I taught her on the disc to get on your spot. So how this works is I have just a foam, easy glide, dura foam disc I got off of Amazon. And I do use a clicker to start her on behaviors when I want to mark something that she did. So I mark a behavior, which means the second that she puts a paw on that disc, I click. Okay, and then I, and then I give her a treat. So I'm, I'm going to click whenever her feet are on the disc. I'm going to try and get it to where you guys can see. So I am reinforcing her sitting on the disc. Her paws are not on it, so I'm not going to click. I want her to sit on it. So now I'm going to reinforce just sitting on it with her feet right, both feet right on the disc. She lays down, I'm not going to respond. And she'll give me a few behaviors, she'll get frustrated. That's frustration. So I'm going to help her sit. Good sit. Now, when you're just starting out, laying down on the on the disc is just fine. And she started to give me behaviors where she's laying down next to it. So I want her sitting on it. So I'm going to reward just sitting on it for now. So that's that's the beginning. That's the first lesson. The second lesson after you've done that once, come back the next day. And you come out and you read, you re, re, uh, redo what you did the day before, uh, just to remind them. Sorry, that was the word I was looking for. Just to remind them, sitting with both feet on is what you're looking for. So she's not, she's now not giving me any downs because now she's getting that I'm only accepting a sit. Good, good on your spot. So, and then you start using the word spot or go to your place or on your mat, whatever you want to use. And I use on your spot, on your spot, good. So I, she now knows it's on your spot, good on your spot, good on your spot, good spot. Okay, then I'm going to take her off the spot, on your spot, and help her lure her there. And when she's sitting on her spot, she gets a click and cheese. So I lure her off on your spot and I click when she's doing what I want. So I'm helping her be successful. I'm not just asking her to do something. Good spot, good spot, good spot. Okay, on your spot. Good, good. Okay, lure her off on your spot. Good girl. Oh, you are a teething young puppy. So, then I get a little bit further away. Hazy, come. And I give her a come command. And I, and this might be, I might start like right here. And then I'll say, on your spot. Sit. So she got there. She's still learning that she needs to sit. Break. I release her. On your spot. No, I sit. Good. So I'm actually asking her for a sit, but she's getting back to her spot just because she knows this. Easy. On your spot. Sit. So she's trying to give behavior. She's trying to figure out how she gets the food. She's making it a little more complicated than she needs to but that's because she's got back up and down and all these things in her brain that she wants to do. On your spot. Sit. Sit. Daisy, sit. Good. Sit. Good spot. Good spot. Break. On your spot. I'm going to accept that because she sat instead of laying down even though it was her rear end that was on the disc. Sit. Good. No. Okay. Sit. You were on it. I got I, the click mark the right point. Good. Break. On your 
same spot. You almost had it, sit. 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 Easy, sit. Good. So I'm being particular because she's getting to her spot. So in the beginning, that's what I, I rewarded. So now I'm giving her a little bit more precise information and she's getting frustrated. She's backing up, she's laying down, she's changing her position. I just kind of w let her think through it. And if I don't think she's gonna get it, I help her out. So we'll do it again. Hazy break on your spot. In your spot. Sit. Yes, good girl. So I'm going to keep working that behavior so I can get her to sit on her spot. Sit on your spot. Easy on your spot. Yes. Just so she's learning not to lay down all the time. But that's essentially how I teach on your spot is you reward for being where you want them to be and then you move them off of it and ask them again. So we're going to transfer it to a towel. Put this up so there's no confusion. So we have a towel here. On your spot. Good. So she's going to learn that she's getting rewarded for being on the towel. Right? On your spot. Trying to get her before she lays down. Good sit. Good spot. So she's learning that she can, that the spot that's different is where she needs to go to. And it, again, you just start by rewarding them for what you want. Good spot. Good spot. And then you take them off of it. You spot. Good spot. Good girl. Good girl. So again, it's just rewarding the behavior that's good. I'm not telling her no except to get off of me. She likes to jump on me. Break. And we walk away. On your spot. Good. See, she's starting to think through not laying down as quickly. So I'm happy about that. Break. Spot. Yeah, good girl. So that's how I teach the location to it to or the specifics to a location is I reward on that I bring them off I take them back and I reward when they're on it and then we work on putting a word to it and then we work on distance on your spot Good. and you can work that with a dog mat a dog bed a crate a table anywhere you want your dog to have a spot and to, to be on a platform and that's their spot so hope that helps on how to uh, teach your dog to get on their spot so uh, happy training and please subscribe to our channel good girl hasty wave come here wave yeah